Mm -hmm. Look, that was so good, nigga. I remember Lowe's was a sophomore varsity. First time got Gang it. can take over. I mean, a gang can take over a country, country. bro. I mean, somebody else could have brought it before her, though. So exactly. I'm, That's what I'm trying to say. Who? So, so that could have been someone that, that the government didn't release. Like, like what up, who? Yeah, like. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy CGTV here, and I'm back here with another video. Today, we got some special guests, and today we're having Car Talk Part 3. He not pushing P. I ain't gonna lie, that shit is smooth. You know how we do? We got the introduction, you feel me? You know what I'm saying? CGTV. Dre, boy. It's gonna be right here. <laughs> Come on now. Ooh, that's hard. I'm gonna talk about first. Let's talk about why Waterburger got these dookie brown bags, bro. <laughs> What's going on, Waterburger? I mean, your food was good, no cap. I mean, I had better. I had better. <laughs> Nah, you always say that I, had I had better, but nah, that was good. They probably brought up. What is it? A, a strike? Oh, a bag short? A strike? <laughs> Man, it's still a bag. All they gotta do is paint it. Just put it white. It ain't gotta be dookie brown, just yeah, white. You go paint the bags. Man, I just want it white, man. It'd be looking dookie brown. <laughs> the food's good, though. Oh, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna tell them my uh, Whataburger order. For so. people that don't know, because some people ain't got water burger. Sweet and spicy bacon burger with no cheese. Oh my goodness. It's like a sweet and spicy. It, it comes together with the bacon. Oh my goodness. I, that was good. Oh my goodness. That was good. With a power aid. Oh my goodness. You can't go wrong. Look, they, they, this is the colors we need, not this. Come back to this, please. That was good. What you got, Kylie? You know what I mean? I like, you know what I'm saying, stay on my same shit. I've been doing this for like a little know. minute now. Oh, I already know. I cut it. Patty with no onions. You feel me? Because I don't like onions. Large fry, large powerade. I ordered a side of honey mustard, but they forgot my honey mustard. So I didn't get to my honey mustard. mustard. I wanted honey mustard. mustard. You feel me? It's so sad. I mean, you know what? Waterbrook is cool though. Because even though I wanted my honey mustard, yeah, I kept it from them, so. And it, it was still, they did that thing, bro. And say? I paid for it. What you think? They, they did that thing, though? <laughs> they did what? They did that thing? He said his french fries were nasty. Oh. Did what thing? Did Waterburger do that thing? Is the food oh. good? <laughs> oh. He yeah, like he don't speak black. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like you don't speak it. Come on, son. I ain't lying, fool. I thought I could speak comfortable. The fries, I ain't lying. The fries could be better. The fries, man, that was good. That could be better, bro. For sure. It was good. I haven't ate nothing all day. That, 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 it hit great. the spot. You know how some just hit the spot? Uh, I was at work all day today. And I didn't eat lunch because I went to Kazi house. I barely made it back to work, so I didn't get to eat lunch today. Oh my goodness, it's dancing. <laughs> I knew I saw some, some twinkling inside of my That's why I look. I'm like, what the fuck is shining on the side of my Oh yeah, I want to get demonetized. <laughs> gotta watch my life. Demonetized? Demonetized. Gotta watch my life. You know what I'm saying? We want to make ra revenue. Revenue. <laughs> revenue. <laughs> revenue. Revenue. <laughs> revenue school. And I'm a college student. Don't try to hold me, man. You know what I'm saying? No. And a hard worker, man. It just. What point was you I don't know about that, but probably. What's A's and B's? That's three point something. Three point something. I don't know my shit, but all I get is A's and B's, literally. So it gotta be something good. Not like high school. Shit. Yeah, what's your major? Uh, education. I'm gonna be a coach. Oh. Uh, yeah, you gotta say you gotta be like a teacher to be a coach. It's the same thing. It made me teach. I'm gonna teach like 
history. I could be a coach too. That's what most coaches teach. Right, they history. do history and it's the easiest. Cause thing. I could be like Coach yeah. Cancer, the AV teacher. Oh, I do AV. They be loud as fuck to be AV teacher and the coach for. Yes, <laughs> that would be hard. Uh, Well, we got quiet. So, we're in College Station. Yeah. How many times have I been to College Station? Well, one, no. Right. My first time. So, oh. Like, I think I passed through it. Don't you got to pass through it to get to Dallas? Oh, no. Yeah, no. 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 Uh, then I Dallas, you'd be using more over there. We, we over here by Brian. Yeah, okay. we over here by Brian and shit. And uh, I never been here. I mean, it's cool. Oh, so far, so far. So Aggie cool. Land. This is Aggie. Yeah, this A and M. Take A and M. Okay. Yeah. yeah. I'm more of a Longhorns fan, but mm -hmm. nah, I'm A and M. I'm A and M. For real? Cause uh, uh what's McCauley? I like what's McCauley for A and M. When Johnny Mendez, Johnny, Johnny Mendez played for that nigga. Was, that nigga was cold. like he was cold, bro. Like Johnny Football, that's what they call him, but he kind of to the NFL. I don't know what happened. That's what be happening though. That damn happened. drink. Yeah. Drink. They be on some other stuff. Man, once you man, college is hard harder than the NFL because you got to do school and football. Once you get in the NFL, it's it's smooth. It's just like, party and play. Yeah, just play. Do your you keep your stuff. It's a lot of plays, bro. That them plays be getting difficult. So I know they. Just, you gotta remember all that. You gotta study. High school, it's all the same. Like it's easy to learn plays, and they be yeah. on the band anyway, so they just tell you. Because they start you off with the play in seventh grade. So you literally it's seventh grade, play. and it's just like they add it more, AD. and it's getting detailed. Like it's What's more detail when you get up. They tell you exactly what to do. Basically. Sometimes I miss that, and sometimes I don't. Like football. I do, and then I don't. Like, Why you don't? Cause, bro, it's like, like, like the effect it had on my body. Yeah, I'm Playing it since I played it since middle school, and it still had an effect on my body. I'd be sore. I'd be yeah, just, I don't know, bro. That shit be hurting. And it only start hurting when I started playing offense my last year. That shit be hurting. You just getting hit, bro. Think about I'm that. I'm the only nigga I did that shit in the school. You just getting hit, <laughs> bro. You just gotta take it, bro. Yeah. I was used to hitting, so that hurt, but it's different than getting hit. Doing the hitting is different, bro. When you're doing yeah. the hitting, you kind of can shake that off. But when you getting hit just constantly, every play, bro, even when you blocking, it's just like, dang. I got blindsided before seven grade. Ooh, I ain't never got blindsided. Bobby Zell White. Yeah, I was actually good at football. I was cold at football. I had 19, 10, 8 games, dude. Kazi was cold, bro. Best short. Running back. Best fourth, 11 running back ever, nigga. And then his brother was running back on varsity. And they both was saying no, but that was hard. Baby be smoked. <laughs> yeah, yeah. How it was called. Coach Bells gave me his number. Yeah. <laughs> That's when football was fun, bro. You can do it. No, like, middle school was fun. Middle school was fun. A grade started getting boring for me. It was fun to be A grade. It started getting boring like junior year. Because seventh grade was our best year. Because A grade, we lost some games. Seventh grade, we No, A grade, we went undefeated. Seventh grade, we lost. My team. Oh. Y'all, it was the opposite for me, us and y'all. You know, so, yeah. seventh grade, y'all went undefeated? Yeah, one yeah, dish, dish of chips. We so went cold, good. and then... That's when Dayton was actually, like, good. <laughs> That's when Dayton used to give us time to run for our money. Dayton was actually good. Just, it was oh, actually a happened? battle of Highway 90. Now, it's just it's torture. Just, it's, <laughs> it's, man, that's slavery. That's, that's bad. We be whooping them. It don't even be fun playing them. Yeah. You see Dayton, you like... It's like, oh, uh, okay. How free, many, week, how many, free week. Free week. How many they finna put so up? Bad. It just, it's That's not so even bad. fun. Like, you can't even look forward to the game because you know you finna beat them bad. Because they're so shit. Yes, bro. And they know they trash. Yeah, why, though? Because they suck. Because they coaching. They used to be good. They used to be good. And then they lost a lot of talent. Oh, yeah. Hey, look how small they be looking. Man. I'm Literally. Like, ants. The nigga. first play they fumbled when I played. I'm gonna look. That was so good, nigga. 
I remember when I was a sophomore in varsity, first time I got in, he played against Dayton. They went in the overtime. This nigga Lowe's, his first, at first time, nigga, on varsity, the first snap, he handed to him, he did a little side side shuffle play, and then he went bounce on the outside and ran the nigga over and scored the touchdown. First, first ever play. play on varsity. And then they started playing him, because at first they weren't playing him. That's cool. That's when Dante was on there? Yeah. At first, they was only playing Dante and um, Craig. Dang, Craig was a freshman. I know. I played with Craig. That nigga cold. That nigga is literally he so is fast. Cold, bro. That's the definition of like, he cold. Like, it's just that simple. He cold. What can you do about it? There's nothing you could do about it. He cold. Everybody, you know what I'm saying? He be moving too, fool. He cold. Bro. Because I remember uh -huh. looking at it on the field and then being on the field when it's happening is completely different. Nigga. Like, bro, it felt like I was just like, he was a flash and we were just moving in slow motion. There's nothing you could do. <laughs> All you see is just, you like, bro, what do you do? Like, sit still for one second, bro. I like, just want to hit him, but you can't. You can't touch him. And don't let him get away. Once he get away. Who that nigga gone. Who <laughs> Kazi, you finna hawk him? And that nigga 40 like a 4 3, bro. He, like, he laser, Kazi, like laser. That's NFL. 4 3, that mean like, as soon as you touch your pinky touch line, the time stop. Nigga, he like, doom, like, nigga, he gone, nigga. That's laser. Tom, hand Tom, he probably like a 4 2. Easy 4 2. But laser, he 4 3, you fast, bro. But CPAT was faster than him because he was long. So in the 200, CPAP will so whoop him. CPAP will whoop him. And, and then he got fast out of nowhere. Huh? That's Jeremiah. Crosby got some athletes. We always did. Like, it's just general. It's like class after like class. Stars, class after class. Class after class. Only one no major state. Take your cousin. I mean, take your son to, uh, what's one call it, guys? Crosby. I'm going to get it right, bro. I'm going back to Crosby. I'm going, yeah, I'm going back. I'm going to build a dynasty in Crosby. Because if he let me build it, I'm going to build it. We're going we gonna to be known as North Shore. If they let me get it. If they let me get to it. Basketball, too. I'm going to see this whole Drake. Basketball, too, Kazi. Send your man, send your son. Basketball, too. I'm going to have him right. He's going to be a star player. I'm, I'm going to know his potential. His potential going to be through the roof, Kazi. Look who his father is. This potential gonna be through the roof. He started, and I'm 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 gonna demand Kazi. I'm gonna demand the best. He gonna hate me. He gonna have to hate me. He gonna have to hate me. I'm I want the best out of you. You gonna have to hate me, Uncle Jay. You gonna hate me now? Love me later, Uncle Jay. Hey, hey, that shit go smooth. Hey, hate me now? Love me later, man. Uncle Dre. Uncle Dre. I hate him, bro, but I ain't gonna lie. He did give me right. I ain't gonna sugarcoat it either. That would be like, like, I'm not gonna sugarcoat. I like how our generation talks about how we're gonna be when we old, but the old generation didn't do that. They just lived through it. They lived. Because they didn't know how, they didn't know how different it was gonna be. You feel me? Like, that's crazy, though. They talking about this metaverse stuff. I don't that's know crazy. about that, bro. Uh, they talking about we're gonna be living in like a simulation. Yes, I've been seeing that stuff. Like literally, like everything gonna be like we in a simulation basically, bro. Without even like no. that's why all them NFTs out, bro. That's gonna help you spend money. The NFTs. And I don't even know how that work. But they say you better invest now, or you gonna be broke in the future. Literally. So you invest from now. I think your money gonna be when it come out. Your money gonna be like already building up because you've been had it. So you gonna be rich in that world, but that's gonna be the real world technically, my nigga. I don't know, bro. That's how they. I'm for real. It's scary, but it's like that's what. That's what we going with this stuff. I don't know. I'm not doing it. I'm not putting on no chip. They be like, let's inject this chip in your head. <laughs> what? No, I only live in real life. I forget that. Like the vaccine. So I, no. Man, the vaccine, bro. We're going to be some zombies. You took it, Gaji? Didn't you get it? Yes, bro. I got oh, it. Yes, you only got it because they wouldn't let you out, bro. bro yes, my been. mom was like, if you want to be out every night, you going to have to get the vaccine because I used to be out every night. She's like, I'm like, all right, that's the least I could do because so she don't have to worry. But I took that, bro. I instantly regretted it. I'm like, I shouldn't have done this, bro. Yeah. It's like, what if they put something in here? Or like, I don't know, bro. Like, 
You yeah. never know what the government, bro. They so yeah. sneaky, everything bro. Everything that's happening right now is in the Bible. Exactly, bro. Yeah, and the Bible be predicting everything, man. I don't know. I wish I didn't take it. But I had to, low key. You took it, Kazi? Exactly, bro. You kind of, my mama, like, she didn't force me, but she, like, she made me feel bad if I didn't. So I'm going to be worrying about you. you I got that hoe home. because I felt like, because I was in college and shit. I was like, bro, I don't want to go yeah. home. And, like, cause my college yeah. was, nigga, my college was booming with COVID. Like, they had to shut out whole shit. Damn. Man. Yeah, that's why I was home for so long and during Christmas break. And so I was scared I would come home with this shit and, like, give it to uh, my people. But, and they end up, you know what I'm saying, with the, from that shit. Like, that's why I was like, I gotta get this vaccine. Yeah, it's, that's how it was. That's how I'd rather just try it and just, you know what I'm saying, know what I can do, sir. And just try to not get it. Man, I'm not gonna be no zombie, I'm gonna fight it. I don't know she had COVID, like, before we even knew about it. Girl. Well, now that she thinks yes. about it, she thinks that that's what it was. Cause I did. I got so sick. Mom was like scared. Before COVID, we was even a thing. It was like November, like late November. Dang. We didn't know about it until 2020. It was around uh, Thanksgiving. No, like it was between that Thanksgiving and Christmas part. During like 2019. Yeah. Yes. Dang. I'm like not getting either. I didn't go to school or anything. Did you I travel or something? No. I was just at home. Damn, yeah, you like got COVID. You probably was patient zero, Autumn. It was crazy. You probably brought it yeah, to Carl. Yeah, she literally... No. <laughs> no, she actually stayed home. Man, and when she one, said... <laughs> when one. she said that she didn't feel good, like, she was around people. Like, she was with me and, like... Because COVID didn't come we to, we like, March. Lot, like, literally. during Thanksgiving break and everything. Cause like, we went spring. Out, we went to the playoff game and just, and we you thought you had the flu or something? No, she thought I it was went, strep. I thought yeah, at that. first I thought it was strep because I normally would get that, but I went to a doctor and they tested me for like everything the flu, strep, even like mono, all that type and of none stuff. Of like it. respiratory. And they didn't, stuff. yeah, they told us that. Like all of it tested negative. Dang, you had, um, you was and a patient was like, one. She was like at home. She was at home it's so much. Either. She said how much she skipped, skipped school. And Damn. then whenever it got to finals week, she only came during finals week. And then um, after we were supposed to go take Christmas pictures, and, and it was didn't? like two days in, like we the day we were supposed to go, we didn't go that day. We just went like two days later. And, and I still she felt still, so yeah, bad. she still didn't even feel that good. You had COVID. If and it didn't test New positive Year's for the news, like you had COVID. Better, like, That's crazy. She was patient one. Somebody must have traveled. I don't know. Nah, uh, that shit came from like China, fool. Exactly. So, but how did he came get, here? How did he get to Autumn, though? Crazy. <laughs> Dre. Think about it. Oh my god. Because at the time, it wasn't even in the USA. I think she, if it didn't test the positive for nothing huh? else, she had COVID. So that means somebody else could have brought it before her, though. So exactly. That's what I'm trying to say. Who? So, so that could have been someone that, that the government didn't release. Exactly. I have a lot of stuff to talk about this. <laughs> Yeah, but they fucking couldn't get it. Yeah. <laughs> Next subject. Man, I ain't scared. Who, okay, they say, who would you rather get hunted by? The FBI or the cartel? FBI. 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 Oh, FBI. I want my body parts. <laughs> Me too. I, at least I, I go to jail. I'm not finna get chopped up, get my yeah, nuts like mailed to my mama. <laughs> nope, I'm off it. Ooh. That's one I was always raised. That's one people you don't fuck with the cartel. The Mexicans don't fuck with the Mexicans. I don't fuck with Mexicans. They got it, bro. Everything they got it. Cause they always deep. Think about it. Okay, Dre. You they don't deep. fuck with the Mexicans. I don't fuck with Mexicans. Oh, they got okay, it. Okay, Dre. They got it. He talking about like the, the cartel was obvious. Yeah, like, like the cartel yeah, was yeah. the like, real <laughs> the Mexico Mexico. Like he talking about like the real was like yes. you know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, like yeah. the real oh, deal. God, the like, real yeah. not yeah. no Hispanics. Like like like, like what up, huh? Yeah, like them. <laughs> Hispanics are like if you was born in the US and you're in you, the back and, and you're Mexican. That's Hispanic. You know what I'm saying? Hey, I ain't gonna lie, my I ain't gonna lie that hey. What up, huh? Your voice acting. <laughs> Carlos and Hector. What the fucker? That's racist. You know, no, it's not, fool. That's not racist, fool. Because it's not racist, Because but the person did it in Friday, bro. He was Mexican. <laughs> but, 
But like, but like they wrote that down for him to do it, bro. But like, he's Mexican, he could do it. But he could do it. <laughs> he could do it. Muddy fucker. Right now. <laughs> well, I don't know. That's not racist, bro. What about the uh? Like, cause we we basically respecting him though. Cause we saying like, don't fuck with them. I'm saying, yeah, I don't miss it. You know what I'm saying? So, like, we're not, we not like, we're not, 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 that's why I'm never going to Mexico. No, I'm not visiting Mexico. You ain't gonna I wouldn't that. feel safe. You wouldn't go to that beach, to Cancun? No. Why? Why not? I wouldn't feel safe. Why? No. If the gang is running the country, what am I doing I went here? To I couldn't do it. I couldn't. Yeah, that country. But like, you Mexican, they gonna know like, okay, she with us. They country is like, like they country is okay, fucked, bro. Me, they gonna be like Negro. They know. They gonna know. I'm done. And I'm snitching. Don't let me get caught by no that's cartel, man. Like, I'm singing. That's kind of fucked You're up. You're singing? I'm singing. Like FBI it. don't scare me. None of that scare me. But cartel is the only group that just like, it just put chills down your back. But that's fucked up they don't, for people that got to live. Not only do they mess with you, they mess with your family. Like, at least keep it with you. You know what I mean? Like, why mail my nuts to my mama? What do she got to do with this? That's what scares me, like. They don't, they don't have no boundaries. That, not they're only like that, bro, but they're running a whole like country for them. Exactly, and they're running a country. How do you man, take over a country? That's scary, nigga. That's crazy. Man, I'm not that's going dangerous, bro. That's scary. If your gang can take over, I mean, a gang can take over a country, bro. They cold. Don't mess with them. They is, bro, like that. Oh, the door's they, locked. That's basically it. Basically, was a kingpin who finally made it and never got caught. That's basically what it was. Because you know, it, it, eventually they always get caught. Are doors locked? Yeah, and they be moving. Yeah, like like that. They be moving, bro. So they finally never getting caught and they took over. Like that's what's gonna happen there because they gonna have so much money and money. You know what I'm saying? That's that's bribery. Exactly. And they take over the government, bro. Like, money talk. That's they, they literally what they do. I don't know how much I got a haircut. <laughs> and then, and then, it literally. Money talk. And then, if you don't agree with them, they kill you, bro. That's simple. I was watching some fight stuff, bro. It's like this cop didn't listen, and they threw the body in the middle of the road, bro. A cop, and they never gonna know who did it. Like what? The, like this is scary, bro. And they, the head probably at his mama house. They don't care, bro. They don't care. That's up, it's bro. fun to them. Bro. That's scary about living in a country like that's, that. That's why we gotta let that's them. That's why they. Yeah, that's why they. Let them in, bro. Yeah, that shit is crazy. Bro. That's, that's why everybody loves coming to America, bro. We don't know we got it so easy compared to all these other like countries. Cause all the fucking, you know what I'm saying? They got all the money, so like, can't nobody get no money because they they taking all the money. They taking all the money. They got everything. They literally run a country. That's why everybody like, yeah. That's crazy to think about. Yeah, yeah, like, they're like so rich to like, <laughs> like they're, just the rich, they're the richest in their country. Like, you know how like, what's that dude called? The one that, on Amazon? Yeah. Uh, Jeff Bezos. It was like, like, he he he's richer than Jeff Bezos. Literally, he's richer than him. Literally, like, but it's not on file. Like, is he getting it illegal? Yeah. But they say they making like over six hundred million a day, bro. Like, <laughs> what? You finna they do that? They literally run the country selling the drugs, yeah. fool. That's crazy. That is fucking crazy, bro. That's crazy. Bro. You ever seen uh, Scarface? I ain't watched it. He was part of like that, like the mafia and all that. And then how they run that stuff, bro, it's so like, I don't know, they make so much money, bro. 500 million. They be going, they be going, they going, 600 they million going like big deals, like big, man, they like moving. Like chances to make champions. Mo they moving it, bro. Like, they not worried about nothing. Man, they moving it, bro. <laughs> Young nigga, move that dope. Yeah, 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 nigga, move that dope. <laughs> that's all they doing. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's all they doing, bro. That's crazy, bro. That's crazy, bro. It's crazy, but it's like, hey, you gotta do what you gotta do sometimes. Yes. I'm finna go to the club.
Hey man, so alright y'all, thank you for watching the video, man. Make sure you hit that like button, comment down below, and make sure you hit that subscribe button. It's CGTV. I'm out.